If you guys like this video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Check out the song I posted yesterday, my intro song. If you guys like it, I'd like that. It seems like you guys are into it. It has over like 5,000 views and 500 likes. Yeah, it's gonna be on Spotify and Apple Music and everywhere, and I'm gonna keep on making music, so just stay tuned for that. Jumping right into this. All right, this is one of the biggest reasons why I see like high schoolers and middle schoolers losing matches. Okay, and it's honestly so simple, but it, it takes like, you have, to, you have to train your brain to think like this, okay? When you're in a match, it's really easy to focus on one thing, all right? When, when you get tunnel vision like this, when you get tunnel vision like this, what it does is it gives your opponent enough time to defend and counter, okay? These things always have to be done in this order to what you're doing, but it can end a match almost as soon as you attack, okay? First, he needs to, if you're shooting, if you're, wh whatever you're doing, you're hitting a half, you're hitting an arm bar, you're, whatever, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Whatever you're doing. First thing you're gonna do is hit the move. He's going to feel you trying to hit it and he's going to defend, he's going to resist. Pull his arm in the opposite way, he's gonna lean the other way, he's gonna sprawl, he's gonna cross fit. you know what I mean? He's gonna resist, he's going to resist. What happens to kids that are losers, all right, kids that lose a lot, they are not created. They stick with the first thing that they that they think of and that's what they commit to, all right? I went for this arm bar, my arm's in here and I, I gotta turn him with this arm bar. You know what I mean? And they're trying to walk it over, they're trying to walk it over, it's not working and then the kid explodes and gets up and out and he's on his feet all of a sudden. The art of wrestling is mainly, mainly about the path of least resistance, okay? It's about being more creative than your opponent. Thinking of things that he's not thinking of in the moment he's thinking of them. All right, he's only human, he or she. They're only human, they can think of one thing at a time, they can defend one thing at a time. You can't defend a double leg and an arm bar at the same time, it's, try it. You know what I mean, you can't, all right? It's just physically impossible, your brain can't do it to defend two things at once. And like you, in the same breath, you can't attack two things at once. But you can switch from one thing to another really fast. And the quicker, you can be you can be quicker as the aggressor than you can as the defender. Does that make sense? So if you if your game if your game plan is to counter, it's a sprawling counter, you like are already starting at a huge disadvantage. Because you're waiting for him to make the first move. You're waiting for him to lead the dance. And you're hoping that when he takes the lead, he missteps and you can capitalize on him. It's better to be the aggressor and find the path of least resistance. I learned this the hard way, okay? I've lost too many matches that I wasn't supposed to lose. Be the aggressor, take the first step, lead the dance, do not get tunnel vision. Do not get tunnel visioned, okay? If the double leg isn't working, switch off to a single leg, switch off to a high crotch, go back to standing, break, you know what I mean? Or go for a body lock, go, there, there's so many different things that you can go for, it's insane. It really is, it really, you're painting a picture. You can throw any color, any stroke, any note, any any chord, it doesn't matter. You, like, like this, is, this is the most creative act a human can do. This is the most raw creative form a human can be, is wrestling and trying to figure out another human. So you have to be creative if you wanna win this. All right, just it's equally as important as endurance, technique, uh, strength, explosiveness, all those things are equally as important as your creativity, your ability to get out of the tunnel, your ability to switch tunnels, okay? You have to have extreme focus in everything you're doing. You have to be extremely, extremely precise and extremely accurate with every single movement you make as a wrestler. But you need to know when it's like when it's too late, when when you need to give up, okay? This will help you so much. This will help you so much. So if you guys like that video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Check out the song I posted yesterday. I hope you guys really like it. Um, working on more music. But until next time, I'll see you guys. Peace.